Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Happy holidays! Whatever you're celebrating or have celebrated. Happy, Happy holidays! Yeah. So we are preparing our Happy Christmas winter. Eve Sorry. dinner because in Portugal, at least in my family, it was the most important one. The most important day was the Christmas Eve where you open the presents and everything. We just wait until it's midnight. So we are going to prepare our dinner, which is a vegan Wellington, but it's not a mushroom one because Ricardo would have diarrhea. <laughs> so we are sauteing carrot, leek, onion, and garlic so far. And then we are going to add lentils instead to uh, make up for the loss of the mushroom. So our rice pudding, it is done. Well, kind of. It's going to the fridge now. Our mousse is also inside the fridge. Yeah, we also did chocolate mousse, like the one we did for the Halloween, but without any worms. <laughs> okay, almost done. Just going to put this over here. Then Just putting the strap around my neck. I don't know if I can do this single-handed, but I shall no, no, try. No, no, no. It's okay, I can do it, actually. Uh, <laughs> Just going to remove fruit. No fruit, only sweets. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm going to... Where are we going to... To the oh yeah, we're going to Ross Pass. <laughs> I just remember that. Um, very important. Yeah. So this is the Wellington. We put this uh, as seasoning as well, and we put some nuts to give some um, something nice to bite on. The fruit is like on the TV unit, right there. <laughs> so, we are just going to spread this on the pastry sheet, on the puff pastry, and then we're just going to put that in the oven, and then we're going to roast we some yes. parsnips. And the now we are going to put this in the oven. Ricardo is doing so that's why I'm doing this alone. <laughs> I'm the camera guy. We, we can we can't just do it all by ourselves. So he's the camera guy. See, I'm glad we didn't put the cheekies, like there was no way it would fit. <laughs> <laughs> this is too much. He put it's a enough. bunch of leaks. It's just just enough. It shall be enough. If this doesn't close, then I'm gonna be upset. It's a bit dark. In it, yeah, but such is life. Wee, mm. Christmas! Okay, what if it is done? Wow! <laughs> it, looks, it looks a bunch of dung. <laughs> but it tastes really nice, I have tried it. So it's not dung? No, it is absolutely Or have delicious. you tried dung and it actually tastes good? Because <laughs> no one has. Okay, Phew. here we are! Okay, so we're putting some roasted vegetables. We're just two people, so <laughs> we don't need that many. I'm just putting some roasted parsnips. And it's gonna be great. Yeah, I mean, we're vegan, so uh, Portuguese food traditions um, obviously have animal products. So we're just trying to try these British vegan food because at least they're vegan. So going to roast 
I mean, they're not vegan, but they have vegan options. Well, no, I mean the parsnips and potatoes and carrots oh. that they usually like in Brussels sprouts. Well, we don't like Brussels sprouts. <laughs> I mean, not that I don't like. I just I rather have other stuff. I'm yep. not a hater of Brussels sprouts. I just I like other stuff better. I, r I like parsnips better. So we having that. Um, well, some people put honey. Well, obviously that's not vegan, but I'm just putting the same. I put for everything, so it's paprika, and then salt and pepper, and some olive oil on the potatoes and the parsnips. Just rolling them, and the Wellington is already in the oven. He has a leaky bottom, so don't make fun of him, guys. When he comes, <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll be back soon. We. Wellington done! Look at it. It's the first time we ever tried this. It has a leaky bottom, like I said, it didn't close. We didn't have enough pastry or we had too much stuffing. Either option. And then our roasted potatoes and parsnip. And then we have a carrot cake in the making. Nine more minutes and it's done. And then we're going to watch a Christmas movie. Until we know which one. <laughs> yeah, we'll figure it out and then afterwards we will talk to our family and open the presents because some of them don't wanna stay until midnight. In Portugal we do it like this, so if you can handle to wait until midnight, you usually just do it before. And that's pretty much it. We'll be back with you guys in a minute. Hello guys! Today is the 25th. We have opened all the Christmas gifts and I am going to show you all of them. I didn't show anything yesterday because we thought we we're going to watch a movie and then start um, unwrapping the presents, but all of our friends and family started to call and obviously that's really good, but we didn't finish the movie. So we're gonna uh, finish it today and I'm going to show you what we got for Christmas. I will take the camera. Okay, so Ricardo got this from me. I gave him a drawing anatomy book and the complete book of drawing because he has been more into drawing and he wanted to learn instead of just having to <laughs> try to guess what he has to do. We also got this with our friend's gift, it's chocolate. I still haven't eaten mine, but Ricardo has eaten his. So, okay, I'm going from here. She gave us these and they're so beautiful. I love stoneware. Oh, I'm gonna focus. And I think they're just so cute. And we have two, so obviously one for each. <laughs> they also gave us this. It's a very pretty picture. So I'm going to keep that as well. Ricardo gave me this and I managed to get the ink stuck in the pen because I am an absolute idiot and I have no idea what I used this specifically piece for. So I just have to figure that one out. I literally got this, the ink stuck inside the pen. Anyways, <laughs> I also got these from my parents-in-law. They gave me this history book. I already have the psychology one. And I'm probably going to get the sociology next. Oh, my mom gave Ricardo this guitar, which is really pretty. And it has nylon strings, like the, the real ones, which is cool. And I don't know if we got anything else. Oh, we also got the pajamas that I was dressing uh, today and Ricardo also got two and I believe that's it but it was really good gifts and we are so happy 
Are we going to eat? Oh, we also got this from our friends. It's just so cute. I love bees. I don't know why, but I do. So at least now I can use this instead of burning my fingers off. And we're going to eat this cake that we did yesterday. And the gift you gave me. I already showed them oh, the okay. books. And I got this pajama. Uh, oh, wait. Switch. Oh, I got this The pajama. lights. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is how it turned out. We I'm still have half of it to eat. <laughs> and I also got maple syrup from my mom. Thank you. She's not from Canada, but she gave me maple syrup. <laughs> I still look at that. We have just finished watching the Christmas Chronicles, I believe, uh, from Netflix. And I forgot to show you other things that we got. So. <laughs> Ricardo gave me this aubergine. Uh, it's like a stress ball, and I'm kind of mm -hmm. erasing his eyes or hers. But it's so squishy. <laughs> and we also have this Ricardo gave me because mine died, so now we have a new mouse that I can use in the laptop because we couldn't play together some games because uh, it's really hard to play without the yeah. uh, mouse. <laughs> We can't. We couldn't walk and look around at the same time. <laughs> yeah, it's really difficult to play Minecraft or anything that you would like to play without the mouse. <laughs> virtually impossible. <laughs> yeah. So now oh, we will to try to set it up and then play a bit together. I believe. I have to verify this again. Mm. Oh, the thing is, it's like six times. I have to do this uh, image thing. Six times so the robots can learn. Yes. Oh, the mouse it's is super good. fast. Jeez. The sensitivity, it's like super fast. We are making breadsticks. We are waiting. They are uh, fat boys. <laughs> we have also another tray here, but it's not showing up very much over here. They are a bit fatter than what the ones you would buy at the supermarket, but they are very nice, I'm sure. We just made basically made the same as you would for bread, so we just mixed yeast with sugar and some warm water. We let that sit in for five minutes, then we mix with the flour. We let that sit, and then we just mix some olives and salt, and we just roll them into sausages. <laughs> They were supposed to be a bit thinner, but it's quite all right. And we are now trying to boil our rice pudding because it wasn't the best. It was still kind of raw. So we live and we learn. <laughs> and now we are going to play, but we are keeping a close eye on the food so we don't ruin it. <laughs> I also forgot to show this gift, which was from Ricardo's father to him. So, we have all of these for the miniatures. I don't know if you know what miniatures are, but they can be from anything. They are Star Wars miniatures, they are Lord of the Rings miniatures, like Warhammer miniatures, those are the most popular ones. And then we have all of these to build scenery with. See? We have a bunch of stuff. This is very cool. It's like tufts of grass that we would glue onto the miniatures. We have grass over here. And some dirt, kind of, and grass. Sorry, I forgot this one, but I remember now. I have COVID. I am sick. I need to go to the hospital. I need to go to the hospital. I have green gas coming out. <laughs> I'm sorry. I 
I'm asleep. I'm asleep. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck <laughs> You can't catch me. <laughs> It's smoke on the water. <laughs> mm -hmm. Blend <gasps> sticks. For I the know this one. As Christmas. Oh. I'm eating red sticks. <laughs> I don't know this, so I'm gonna stop. They chunky. Mm. Okay. General knowledge. Ew, I'm not gonna ask you about some capitalist brand company. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna ask you about Harry Potter. Oh, why transphobic? <laughs> what are the four school houses in the Harry Potter book series? Ravenclaw, Gryffindor, Slytherin, and Hufflepuff. Yeah. Have you asked so like many? It, festive, festive. You've asked so many? Oh my god, this is so easy. What type of tree is traditionally used as a Christmas tree? A fir tree. I had read that one, so... <laughs> I would say pine, but... Yeah. I have no idea as so. well. Yep. No, oh, you do know this one. Somebody to love? Somebody that I used to know. Somebody that I used to know. Okay, you know this one as well. Dancing Queen. Oh, the food is red! Oh! <laughs> it's the oldest. Christmas movie that I've ever watched, I think. That I can remember. <laughs> we are also going to paint our miniatures. These are the miniatures we are currently painting. This is kind of what they're supposed to look like. <laughs> and this is, uh, yeah, the, this is the unpainted ones we have. And then we can add the scenery stuff we got for Christmas. Mm -hmm. These ones aren't finished yet, but they look really good actually. Mm -hmm. I can't show because making my won't focus. Mm. Yeah, you, you kind of, you got the gist of it. <laughs> I think I was painting two or three. I think I was painting, oh yeah, those three. <laughs> <laughs> He's eating rice pudding, which didn't turn out as good as pizza. It turned out dry. Dry than the first time, but the first it, time was good, so... Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So, we shall try again and again, again until we succeed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, so this is the end of our Christmas video. Christmas for us isn't really about religion, it's more about family and spending time together. And I'll let Jenny speak now. <laughs> I'll be here. So I hope you guys watched, uh, enjoyed watching this video. 
don't forget to hit the jingle bell Whee! and also subscribe we are hoping uh, that this next year it's like a better year than today than this year i mean yeah. and we'll see you in the next one